guys welcome back to a brand new video so today i'm gonna take you guys along with me we're gonna hang out at home too it's gonna be a very mixed well i think we are who knows <laughs> but the plan is larry and i need to go to the store we need to pick up a few things boring things such as a garbage can for outside um and then just a couple of other odds and ends that i will share with you guys and we also need to stop at PetSmart. bless you luna um, we need to pick up some kitty litter and I also want to pick up those plugins to help relax kitties and calm them because Lexi's always been kind of like an anxious kitty, but she's starting to what they call mow and she's licking the fur off of her belly and I've taken her to the vet for it before and in the past so she has been checked, but she's licking more. It can also be signs of skin irritation or fleas, which she doesn't have. And again, as I said, we took her to the vet for it before and it's an anxious behavior and she does this thing with her back where it like ripples so we thought we should go to PetSmart and pick up some of those I forget what they're called but I'll show you it's an it's safe for cats safe for dogs safe for animals and you just plug it into your their your whoa <laughs> you plug it into the wall and it helps naturally relax them so we'll see I remember getting them when I first got Lexi and Luna to try and calm Lexi down and it didn't really work, but that's because Luna was still a new kitty in the house and it was a long introduction period to get them used to each other. But anyways, I'm rambling on about that. And yeah, I just thought we could hang out for the day. It's a beautiful day. Bless you, babe. We have gorgeous 80 degree weather again. We've been very, very fortunate with our weather as of lately. Our humidity is back though. It is currently going on 11 o'clock. So I figured I would quickly make lunch before we go out for the day. Just today as I'm filming this video, oh, it's Wednesday. So I actually am getting ready to go on a road trip very soon to meet up with my best friend, Angela. And it does sound like we are going to film the trip. I checked in with her. And I talked to her, I'm like, I kind of like, I'm torn. Like I wanna spend all like one-on-one -on -one time, but I also love filming that because I love looking back on those memories. And she's like, well, I thought we were filming. And I'm like, well, okay, so let's film. Um, that's gonna be a really exciting time. So I'm looking forward to that. I'll be leaving in a couple of days. So today's currently Wednesday and I'll be leaving Saturday early morning and we're meeting like at a halfway point. So it's about a three and a half hour drive and a four hour drive for her. So. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. But anyways, guys, I could just ramble on at you guys forever. So let's go make some lunch. Let's head to the kitchen. So the lunch that I'm gonna be making today is by Green Chef. So today's video is sponsored by Green Chef. You guys know I love working with them. I've worked with them for over a year now, I am pretty sure. And I'm very thrilled and excited and thankful to be working with them through this year. So today that is what we're gonna be making if you guys are unfamiliar with Green Chef. Green Chef is a CCOF certified organic meal kit company that helps you cook clean, delicious dinners week after week with the step-by-step -step recipes and pre-measured premium ingredients that save you time. Green Chef has changed the meal subscription kit game with options for every lifestyle, including keto, paleo, vegan, vegetarian, fast and fit, Mediterranean and gluten-free. I have been ordering the vegetarian box the last two boxes, I believe. All of their meals are incredible. You get to pick from different options. Let's see what we have. Oh my gosh, caramelized onion and apple melts. Larry, you might like that. Oh my gosh, look at that. We also have roasted chickpea and fig couscous bowls. <gasps> that sounds lovely. And spicy California, I almost said California, spicy cauliflower with za'atar, za'atar tahini. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Sounds delicious. Ow, pumped into my box. Now to unpack the goodies. 
With Green Chef, your meals come pre-portioned and ready to go for you, which is really nice. They give you a pamphlet on the front. It tells you how much cooking time the meal is gonna take and a basic idea of what the meal is. And on the back, you have really easy step-by-step -step instructions. I love making my Green Chef meals because it teaches me, number one, how to create things that I normally wouldn't. And then I get to keep the pamphlet so I can go back and cook things later. I have also tried their keto plan, which is really good. So if you have not tried their keto plan and you're on a keto diet, it's incredible. So I highly recommend that. So this is what your bag will look like. And it comes with all of your fresh, pre-portioned ingredients ready to go. Green Chef makes cooking easy so you can spend less time stressing and more time enjoying delicious home-cooked meals. Green Chef has a wide variety of high quality, clean ingredients you can feel great about when you're eating and how it goes on your table. If you guys would like to give Green Chef a try, Meg? That was so cute. <laughs> Go to greenchef.com and use code MindyMinx130 to get $130 off plus free shipping on your first box. Green Chef, thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. We have made it to the car. And we're actually gonna go to get my brows done. Guys, I haven't had, oh, we're getting really crazy reflection off my water. I have not had my eyebrows done in a very, very long time. I don't have any product in them today. I just kind of brushed them up. And I want them to stay thick, but I just kind of want them, like she does this great job. I get them threaded, but she trims them so they're nice and like, psh, psh, and it's just really great. So I'm gonna go see her. Larry's coming in the car in a minute. So I want to see her, and then then we're going to stop at Walmart. So, do you guys hear that cardinal behind the car? It sounds so cute. This sounds, I did like a messy kind of hairstyle today. Like, I made it really loose, and I pulled all the frillies out. I don't know. I kind of like it. <gasps> I got to give you guys an update about the NARS tinted. That's what I'm wearing today is the NARS tinted um, moisturizer. I'm obsessed with it. It does leave that kind of like tacky feeling. So I do set it with a translucent powder just because I don't really like the tacky feeling, but it's incredible. I have a lot of new favorites with products that I've purchased. Incredible. Hello, darling. Hello. How's your day going so far? It is going very nicely. Thank you. Very well. That's good. Let's go. Put this on so we don't get the beep, beep, beep. Yeah, we don't want the beep, beep, beep. Also, when I wear these sunglasses, a lot of you guys ask where they're from. They're from Target, but they're from Target last year, so I don't know. But that is where I picked them up at. What kind of music do we want to listen to? Whatever you want to listen to. I'm currently listening to Game of Thrones. That's fine. Jakatis. We have to listen to that. We should. Or did it just end? I don't know. I don't know either. Convertible with the top down. Oh, yep, it's ending. What a shame. I love the cars. All right. I like to see convertibles with the top down. A lot yeah. of people don't put their tops down. Yeah. Probably get sunburned. Maybe. Oh, it's very dark. Really dark. Why is it so dark? Brows are done. Take a look at them. Do they look better? I like them. They're nice and trimmed. Again, I don't have any product in them or anything, but they're um, nice and like more manageable. So. And Larry went to Best Buy. I did. And what did you look at? I looked at some drones and was hoping to find some things to go with the drone. Uh, lens covers and things, but evidently they don't sell those in store anymore. You have to go online to look for them. That seems to be the new common trend. Yeah. I feel like I have eyelashes now in my eye everywhere, which I probably do. Not eyelashes. Eyebrows. I hope she didn't throw me eyelashes. <laughs> that would suck. All right. We're headed to Walmart now to get like cosmetic-y things, soaps. We need garbage cans, essentially. I already told you guys that. It's like, you know, fun item. And yeah, then- and all the exciting stuff. Guys, Walmart was an adventure, let me tell you. It was crowded, and then they had only three um, aisles open, and we waited in line for about 40 minutes. But we made it, we got it. Uh, we loaded the car. We got more than we anticipated to get, of course, because I don't know. That seems to always happen. But Larry just ran in because the garbage cans are in the garden center. So he's purchasing those. And I came for a little snack because I got really, really hungry. And Rice Krispies came out with the home style kind of Rice Krispies. So they have like marshmallows in them. And I'm very excited to try it. Mmm. Mm-hmm. But 
I didn't want to get these because I want to make Rice Krispies at home. But Larry talked me into it, so we got them. Mmm. And then for my mom's birthday a while ago, she wanted the triple chocolate cake. And I accidentally got the wrong cake. So I saw it and I felt bad that I got the wrong cake. So I picked up the right cake this time. And I'm going to drop that off to her. And then I don't know if you guys are familiar with Utz Chips, the brand. I think it originates in PA, but my family from Maryland, we've always had Utz. And my parents love them and they have crab chips as well, which are really, really good. So I picked up some of those to drop off to mom and dad too. But first, we're going to wait for Larry to get in the car, obviously. not going to leave him here. And then we're going to head home, unpack our car, and then head over to Mom and Dad's and drop off their stuff. But we're not going to stay. I'm just kind of dropping it off. Hmm. Whew. I don't know what it is with pregnancy. I'm prone to sugar drops anyways, guys, but you cannot go long without a snack when you're pregnant I will tell you that I'm like I could feel my sugar dropping I could feel my heartbeat and I'm like oh my gosh what's happening <laughs> mm. we have just got home so I'm going to show you guys a couple of the household items that we picked up at Walmart okay this is not a household item but I had to share it with you guys <gasps> rice crispy treat coffee mate oh my gosh it's new I'm super excited to try it so yay for that I'll let you guys know how it is Larry picked up some NyQuil, my contact solution, and oh, I always use this Dove Bar of Soap, and then I saw that they now make it in the little hypoallergenic like squeezy tubes for the body, so I got that. We have Crest 3D White, my vitamin D3. This is like a little, this was in the pet aisle. It's a kitten bottle feeder, bottle dropper. Baby animal. Baby animal. So because it's going into the baby season here, just in case something happens, Larry picked up a little baby bottle for animals, which is so cute. And then advanced silicone. Hawk stuff. Okay. Larry picked up some lens wipes. I picked up these resistance bands. I was going to um, pick up some weights. I do have some bands, but I don't have the ones that loop all the way around. So I picked up these to start using. And then Tylenol PM. Tylenol, currently the only thing I am allowed to take during pregnancy, of course. Uh, toothbrushes. The the ones at Walmart that I, okay, hold on, I'm gonna explain this. These are mine. Those are yours. Yeah, Larry got some toothbrushes too, but for outdoor projects. So I was looking for an electrical, electrical, electronic toothbrush, but um, they were all locked up. You couldn't just grab one off the shelf and it was just packed in there. So I was like, well, screw it, I'll just get a regular, oh my gosh, I almost whacked myself in the face, a regular one like this. So anyways, that's everything we picked up. I'm gonna get it put away and then we need to run out the door. The poor kitties are very anxious to go outside. It's so sad, but we don't let them out while we're gone and we're running back out the door. So we're gonna get to mom and dad, drop that stuff off and then get back here so we can let the girls outside. All right, so it is currently five and I am ready to take my makeup off my face. Do you guys ever get to that point where you're just like, it has to come off? I'm to that point where We've been out all day and I just wanna relax, unwind, get this makeup off. So I figured why not show you guys me taking off my makeup and what I've been using as of lately. So, all right, let's see if I can get you guys set up there. Is that a weird angle? Totally, but it's about the only angle that we're gonna be able to, no, I could put you guys in the thing. No, I'll just leave you there, it's all right. Just know we're at a really bizarre angle. I always take all of my jewelry off when I wash my face because it just runs into it and slides down. Should we do a little bump update? I'm doing bump updates over on Instagram, but I know a lot of you guys aren't over on Instagram, so I should do a little bump update for you guys. Let's see. You get it at a good angle. That's not a good angle. You can't see. All right, let's see. There we go. Let me pull it down. Maybe that'll be helpful. Can you see? Definitely got the, the little bump going on. That is for sure. <laughs> so that's bump update. Now let's get back to washing the face. I always have to put my hair out of my face. This is the weirdest angle. Oh no, my camera's gonna die. No! 
All right, so I'll just run through the, wait, I took one earring out, not the other. I'll just show you guys the products that I use. This is for my nighttime skincare. So let's just quickly run through it. All right, to take off my makeup, I use this. It's the Bosha Makeup Breakup Cool Cleansing Oil. So I'll rub that all over first and I really massage that in well and then I'll emulsify it with water. Then I go in with my cleanser, which is by First Aid Beauty. Fragrance free, it's wonderful. New favorite vitamin C serum ever. I will never buy anything else, honestly. This is just, oh my gosh, I love it. And it's the CEO by Sunday Riley. This is incredible. I bought the small bottle because I wasn't sure if I would love it, but I do. And then I finish it with my moisturizer. So this is my current nighttime skincare routine. Um, so yeah, I don't know. I'll list the products down below for you guys if you're interested and want to check them out. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna get to wash my face before this camera dies because it is flashing at me. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and hanging out with me. And if you did give this video a thumbs up, leave a comment down below and I will see you guys very soon.